Hello there everybody, it's me new from Rockstar, welcome to the video. Today we're playing Pokemon 3 Dungeon, and my god, they keep just adding more and more plot twists to this thing. I have no idea when this thing's gonna end, I give up on trying to, to guess. It's just... So many plot twists. Um, last time I also fixed my inventory, I'm pretty sure, and I gave myself a bunch of needed stuff, if we ever get into, um... And something like we need. Uh, probably also have to deposit a bunch more items, which I completely forgot. Like, we don't need this, or this, or this. Chesto berry, sure. Um, keep doing some more Chesto berries, grab that, don't eat that. Oh, that's a lot of max elixirs. I'm gonna get rid of some of these. And I think that that should be pretty much it. Yep, store all these, and then give it a good old save real quick. And uh, hopefully they'll have been enjoying these videos. I've, uh... I've been having so much fun recording them, it's just, it's so long, I expected this to end long ago. Let's just get straight into it. Hopefully all have been, have watched the last video, if you haven't, then just go back and watch it, I guess, because like, a lot of things happened in the last video. But hopefully, in the near future, we're gonna reach the last, um, the last episode of this. Explosion trap, oh no. Ah, oh, that's a lot of damage. Uh, in the near future, we'll, we'll reach our last ever video of this game, and so I'm kind of excited for that. As sad as I am to end this series, but I'm, it's it's gonna be super exciting to see what happens in the end. That's not good. That's a full-on Metagross. It used to be a Metang. All right, well, time to one shot it. There we go. <laughs> All right, that's pretty cool. All right. Trans oh, sleeping gas, that, that's Ditto using Crest Normal. Alright, you know what? If anything interesting happens, this is just a good old normal dungeon. If anything interesting happens, I'll be back with y'all. If nothing happens, then I'll just see you in the end of the dungeon where hopefully there's going to be a boss battle. I'll see y'all soon. Goodbye, everybody. Finally, my god. We just wasted four Reviver Seeds on that past dungeon. The dungeon right now, I, I did right now, I'm gonna show you a clip probably. I wasted three reviver seeds, maybe even four, because Driftblim just kept spamming Ominous Wind and he has an ability which speeds him up and Ominous Wind kept boosting him up and so both me and Dustwar, who's, who's weak to uh, uh, Ominous Wind, kept dying again and again. Holy crap, that was so annoying. I think I'm, I don't have any more Reviver Seeds, which I'm kind of scared. But we'll see what happens. Looks like we made it through. I think the Sableye are up ahead. Let's proceed with caution. Luck save? I honestly don't know. I have a save state in the beginning. <laughs> so I'm not that worried, but we'll see what happens. Alright, so we're at the top. It says... Looks more. It looks like the deepest part of this ice-covered forest. Over there, I can see a remarkably large ice pillar. There's a mysterious feeling in the air. Is that? A oh god, Grovan! Look, over there, just past those four huge pillars. Can you see anything? Yes, I can. Looks like someone's lying there, unconscious. Come on, unconscious. Someone. Ah, that is. Celebi with Superior Tomb. Celebi, can you hear me? It's me, it's Grovile. Is someone holding you back? There's an odd keystone nearby. That means Spirit Tomb. Ah, there it is. Spirit Tomb, you. Why have you done this to Celebi? You're wrong. You're wrong. This was. This was not our doing. Don't lie. Explain why Celebi is like this. You've done this to me before, so I know it's you. Besides, if you didn't do this, Celebi, then who else would have, could have? Oh? What? What's this sensation? Why? I, I don't understand why. Every nerve in my body is bristling. Th this is a bad sign. My instincts are screaming out that something is very wrong. But where is this feeling coming from? Y you're wrong. Please, no. Please believe us. What is it trying to tell me? This overpowering sense of dread. Who is it, the henchman? What have I failed to understand? What am I wrong about? C cruel vile! Celebi, you're awake! Y you! You sure picked a strange time to wake up! 
If we'd let you flee, we... Let Celebi go, Spiritomb. If you won't let her go, I'll knock you out. Don't make us use force. D don't come near. What? Oh no. We're dead. Ha, <laughs> we did it. Ah, you. Ah, my strength. I'm losing my strength. Th this is... Um, we can go now, right? We're all done here, so we'll just be on our way. Behind Grovile is Daswar. We can go, right? What What are you saying? <laughs> Get a hold of yourself, Spiritum. Remain with us a little longer. On the Sable Eyes. Oops. I accidentally clicked the, the OBS thing. <laughs> I'm laughing and I okay, I'm not gonna do that. My voice isn't that well. Dustmar, you! What's going on? Listen, Grovile. Master Liaga's new henchman from the start was never revealed. What? Everything everything has gone according to my plan. This icicle forest is a special place. If you're hit by the electrical discharge of these ice pillars, your spillet will be melted away. It was surprisingly easy to get uh, to get you to stand in the center of these four pillars. That's where your power is the most is the most concentrated. My, my spirit will be melted away. My plan, elegant and useful. It's this. Rovile, I lured you here for this purpose. After your spirit has been melted away, I will use your body and in your place, I will return to the past. What? If Rovile goes back to the past, Jaras and Evening will be so incredibly happy, don't you agree? They won't be the slightest bit suspicious. They will accept you, accept you as their friend. Sadly, the two innocents will be unaware of the flaws of their happiness. The body will be Grovile's, but the conscience will be me. Everything we've done has been in preparation for this. The new agent, in fact, Grovile, it's you. Ah, I see. No, oh no, that's not. This can't be real. I mean, when did you plan? You and I returned together to this world from the past. There wasn't any time when you could have told the this plan to the Sable Eyes. So how did you? No. There was time. That time. When we returned to this world, and we saw the Sable Eye for the first time. Sable Eye? Found me already, I've got a guy Yeah, that's in the first episode. But this one was still unconscious then. I thought I was the first to, uh, of us to wake up. I wasn't correct. It was the other way around. That's why I got consciousness before I did. So I wake up first and talk to the Sable Eye. This plan of his. <laughs> it's taken you long enough to catch on, Grovile. Oh no. You've been in my way the entire time. And now it's your time. Now your time is up. And when I inhabit your empty shell and return to the past, it will be Charles Blake to take down Charles and Evening. You up now and let your spirit be melted away. No, Grovile. Oh, was I? Was I too trusting? I thought I could, but I believed you. That's right, Grovile. The only really point is that you're too kind. I've said it before. Allow me to repeat it for emphasis. I really despise you. Even when I shielded you, it was simply according to plan. You coward! <laughs> you can babble whatever you like. In the end, you have lost. You've lost because you trusted me. No, I don't believe that. I... I wasn't wrong. I... I still trust you. Do my ears deceive me? <laughs> you say that even after all I've done. You still have trust in me? D yes, despite that. I know what's in your heart, Dustmar. We've had a moment of understanding. Hm. Then we have nothing of the kind. Ah, yes. I'm sure as sure can be. While we were on our adventure, when we were passing through the dungeons, surmounting all the challenges, while you were behind me, at some point I sensed that your feeling of hatred vanished. What, what are you saying? That's impossible. I meant what I said. I despise you. That is all I sensed. That is all you sensed. I don't know. 
I ask you to remember more carefully. It's not just sometimes I sense. I'm very cautious, even with caution in place. While we were in this adventure together, I decided to trust you, because I could sense your spirit. A spirit of loyalty. I could clearly sense your spirit. Your shining spirit. Shine? Shining. My spirit. Mine. You've pledged loyalty to Primal Dialga, so you're trying to protect this world of darkness. But that just comes from this desire not to disappear. But really, for you more most of all, is that enough? To survive like this, here? Is there any honest happiness in that for you? The meaning of life? Think of what it truly means to live, Duskmar. What it truly means to live. My meaning. Ooh, are we gonna get a flashback? I thought I was gonna get like something from his old life or something. He is a ghost type, you know? He's supposed to be dead. That's why he, he, he gets very emotional when we talk about his spirit. While I live, I want to shine. I want to prove that I exist. If I could do something really important that would definitely carry on to the future. No, not just into the future. In Charles and Evening's future too. My spirit has become a part of them, I believe. In them, my spirit is alive. And that spirit could be passed along to the others. And so if I were to disappear, I think all that I would have accomplished will go on. That is, that would mean that it's living, right? Even if I disappear, I still live on. My spirit is alive. That's it. It's, your life is all about what you do. So, uh, again, after you die, people will remember what you've done. So, yeah. Even if I disappear, my spirit is alive. Please remember Dust Farm. What is sensed in the dungeon at that time? Your shining spirit. M my spirit? There is nothing that... Nothing shines like that. You're... You're... De you're deluding yourself. Oh no, Duskmar. Master Duskmar, are you alright? Shut up. Oh no, the poor Sable Eyes, they didn't do anything wrong. Am I... Has my spirit become a part of others' minds? Then, Proviles, existence. Only... It's too late now! Oh no, Duskmar. It's the same for you. Have you ever thought of the future or a new life? Giving to Primal Dialga and living your whole life in darkness? Is that truly what you want? Sableye, what does your heart tell you? Sense your self-respect, or has it gone? Yeah, the Sableye, they didn't do anything wrong. They're just following orders. It's not their fault. Oh no, Grovile! The electric, the electrical discharge is getting stronger. C can't hold on. My strength, my strength is draining away. If this goes on, Grovile can't. Spirit tomb. You can't let this happen. If you move, you can move, can't you? Do something. Uh, uh. Well, spirit tomb is like a million, not a million. It's like a hundred spirits all together. So you can like waste one of them. It's no good. My vision. It's going white. My spirit is going to melt away. Oh no, Grovile, no. Oh. My consciousness is fading. My consciousness, my spirit, finally fading. Oh? Sound effect? D Duskmar. Master Duskmar? Master Duskmar rescued Grovile. Th this is... Grovile, are you alright? Uh, barely. Duskmar, you saved me. Oh? Um, hello? Oh no. Wait, no. <laughs> no. Um. Oh god, it's, it looks a little bigger than I remember. M Master Dialga. Oh no, someone's mad. Oh no. Master Dustbar. Oh no, I'm gonna have a boss battle here. Oh no, Dustbar, you didn't do anything wrong, no. Uh. Oh no, you must protect him! Let's go! Oh god, you're gonna do nothing. It's a steel type. What are you gonna do if you can scratch? <laughs> y you. Ah, need to move. My body won't do what I tell it to. Oh uh, yeah, he's still pretty weak. No, that's one. Oh god. 
Spirit tube. Come on, just, just do something. Can you, like, run away or something? Thank you. <laughs> My paralysis is gone. Dialga. Stop. Don't slap me. What? 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 Huh? The future! Oh, it's changing! If I remember right, that's called an aurora. Huh? <laughs> that's what I imagine Salemi is just going, huh? A wind. A wind has started blowing. Time is moving! And up in the sky, there's an aurora. That means the sun. The air has started to move. The planet's paralysis has started to move again. Could it be? History has finally changed. You did it, Charas. Evening. Oh no, it's changing. Oh, this might hurt. Maybe? Are you gonna just disappear? Primal Dialga has become ferocious. Oh no, it's just mad. Okay. <laughs> okay, I guess it's, he's, they're just angry. Oh, Roar of Time. Oh. And the. Uh, we're dead. Or it's just disappeared. Is Dustmar okay? Master uh, Dustmar! Don't worry, I'm fine. It's more important to follow more Master Dialga. The rest of you, take care of Govile and Celebi. Hurry. Uh. Wait, but. Where did. Where did Lawrence Boyd go? Where did we go? I didn't see us. Did it teleport us? Are we, are we dead? Are we dead? No, okay, I guess we, um, we got back up. Did you really go this way? Y yes, there's no mistaking it. Astro Dialga was enveloped in this light, and then he vanished in the direction of this awesomely vast mountain. It's hopeless. What's wrong, Celebi? At the pinnacle of this mountain, there's a passage of time. You know what's strange? Even though I was caught, I never said where the passage of time was. Master Lugialga went into even more of a rampage. He's no longer acting rationally. Maybe this thing pressed by his increasing ferociousness made him made him head for the passage of time. If Dialga were to hit the passage of time while he's not in his right mind, what would happen, Dasmar? That occurs now that the world has finally started to move. I don't know what would happen. We need to stop him quickly. Hmm, that's scary. The light has gotten much brighter, huh? The sun is rising. Dawn is near. Took a long time to blah 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 because I had twitchy fingers and I accidentally clicked. From here on, Grovile and I, and Slubby, will move as a group of three. We need to fight as hard as we possibly can to stop Master Dialga. But on the other hand, we'll be far less mobile if we bring the Sableye along. If we're not in time, then that's the end. Understood. All right, let's prepare and then let's go. Master Dustmar, Grovile, Salami too. What is this? We're ready too for the future. Master Dialga needs to come to his senses. Yes, I understand. This is the final fight. We must bring Master Dialga back to his senses. That's right. That's what I've been fighting for all this time. Just a little more. Huh? What was that? Ooh, some light. Don't tell me. Don't tell me this. They're starting to disappear. Huh? Grovile, what's wrong? No, it's nothing. Jarez, just a little more. Everything we've done so far. Just a little more and we can achieve our goals. Till the end, or I disappear. Lend me your strength, Jarez. Ah, oh, and we're starting to disappear, and that's that's scary. Because we have to we have to try and try and save everyone before we actually just completely blink out of existence. Sheesh, that's scary. We're on a timer. Man. Alright, everybody. That's gonna be pretty much it for this episode. I know that I'm just pretty much leaving it on a cliffhanger. But, like, I cannot anymore because, um... It's already been so much. And I need to, like, um... Oh, we still have some, some Reviver Seeds. And look, we have the Plane Seeds, which have been used because it was Reviver Seeds before. Um... I have to go because I've been recording for quite some time, so thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next video. Until next time, take care. Next episode, definitely going to be the last episode when we're going to see Grovile probably disappear. It's going to be very emotional and very sad. Man, this game is just amazing. I'm just so excited. Well, 
Sound like it's going to look like Take care. Goodbye, everybody.